Hardberger now. Is he coming into the pits on this lap? This is lap 17. If he keeps on going consistently, and into the pits now comes the Williams, and Gerhard Berger goes through. David Coulthard is coming in from 12th position, and uh, there is no activity around the Williams. It's not a tyre stop, so this looks like the, uh, yet another, the 13th retirement in the German Grand Prix. And Michael Schumacher is in trouble. Did you see that burst of smoke from the back of the car? Is to Jonathan, your view? Well, his engine sounded dreadful. Just as he came past us in the commentary box, the engine sounded dreadful. I am sure Michael Schumacher has a terminal engine problem there. Well, he's been forcing, yes, that is Schumacher, and he's going visibly slower. He's going visibly slower. This, the, the, the crowd will be absolutely distraught. So will Michael, of course, because he was desperately hoping to become the first German to win his home Grand Prix at a World Championship event. And Michael Schumacher looks to me as though he is virtually touring in now. Something very dramatic has happened at the back of the car. I'm not going to say it was engine because I don't know, but, uh, oh, there he is. You're looking back at him now, and he's, uh, he's he's banging his fist in sheer agonised frustration. is coming in to the pits now he's safe he's safe he will have had a message from the ferrari radio system to say that michael schumacher is out because they can watch television just as easily as we can and you are watching race leader gerhard berger who is now 32 seconds ahead of olivier parnis making what may be his only tire stop it's quite a long stop there for Gerhard Berger. Looks like they, in fact, they may have, no, he's OK. He is putting a lot of fuel on board that car. In fact, he's for sure lost about six seconds, six or seven seconds, though. He should have had, I think, about nine or ten seconds worth of fuel. He stopped on lap 20. That's as we thought for making just one stop. But some kind of a problem. I don't think it'll cause him uh, any significant problem in terms of the result. As Schumacher comes into the pits now, and that surely must mean retirement for Schumacher. And it's a very, very close thing for first place at the moment because as Gerhard Berger drove out of the pit lane, thundering past the commentary boxes which are on the start and finish area, went Olivier Parnis. But during the race, Berger was lapping, of course, a lot quicker. And this indeed is the bitter sight for the people in the grandstands and for the Benetton team of Michael Schumacher, who has won so many races this year that even with his penalty after Britain he's leading the world championship by 27 points retiring from the German Grand Prix